19 minutes to nine. Good morning. Let's dive into the news to take a look at some other stories. And uh, Alex, I think you've got a bit of a quiz for us uh, yes, this I morning. Yes, I do. This is because yesterday, I don't know if anyone will know, but the uh, new British banknote uh, came into circulation. So this is the new £20 polymer banknote featuring J.M.W. Turner. So that entered circulation in uh, Britain yesterday. And so how well do you know your banknotes is a, oh, a no. question that's popped up. <laughs> oh, crikey. And, uh, and the people on them. So perhaps we could try a couple, see, see your knowledge. Do I think this is going to be harder for, for Manxies because oh, we yeah. have all kinds of notes. We do, but I mean, we also have the regular kind of British well, bank notes. True. So there's no <laughs> real excuse. my excuses excuse. in. Yeah, yeah. yeah fair I'm, enough. I'm, I'm with you, definitely, Sean. I think Sean. you might be right. I mean, Sean is the dark horse. You know, you are such a good quizzer. So I think you'll be <laughs> I think fine. this is code for spends a lot of time trawling Wikipedia. Well, that's fine too. Um, so first question, which famous bill made his way onto the £20 note released in 1970. And you have three options. William Wilberforce, William Shakespeare or William Blake. What do we think? Now, I think Shakespeare was on a note at some point. Okay. See, I, I, I was, was going to say note. Shakespeare myself. I don't know I'm, the answers, I'm, I'm, by the way. I'm going to go for Wilberforce. Okay. okay. So we're, we're both I going Shakespeare. Shakespeare. Let's have a look. And... The answer is Shakespeare. Oh, there you yeah, go. Yeah, there we go. She, she, yeah, you bang on there, Sean. Yeah. <laughs> so, no, another one? Do you yes. Have time for yeah. One? Okay. yeah, let's do it. What year did the Queen's face last change on a banknote? 1990, 2005, or 1972? I'm going to go because I'm just thinking, and I was thinking this very recently, that she looks quite young on the banknotes, oh, okay. I, I think. So I'm going to go I, for the, the the older, was it 1970 something? No, I'm you struggling say? to actually find the answer on this I one. think she looks older than 1972 on oh, them. I, I, I have a vague that. recollection of suddenly seeing notes and thinking, oh, she looks a bit more jowly. Looks oh, a bit more jowly, <laughs> which I'm, is actually I'm, sort of goodness. sending me I'm, towards 2005. It's but... not giving me the answer, which is very upsetting. Oh, well, <laughs> now just, how just am I supposed to tell you? you? What, I'm, never know. what I'm doing is I'm rooting in my wallet to try and find some of their cash. <laughs> I've only got euros, I can so that's... See. Uh, well, that it's, it's showing me a picture <laughs> of the note, and she does look young in it, but I just, it's a £50 note. Well, I'm going for 72 then. What are you going for? I, I'm going the other way. I think, was it 2005? Okay. Is that an option? Why tell me? We'll consult... We'll consult Uncle Google. What a Google. rubbish quiz. I'll <laughs> find out uh, uh, yeah. by the end of Have You Heard. You we'll, talk we'll, amongst yourselves. We'll come back to that. Uh, part two to be resumed of Alex's story. Shana, what have you got for us? Well, if you do find your money, you might be interested in spending it on a very highly anticipated collection of toys oh, about right. to be released by Disney. So this is from the Disney Plus series, The Mandalorian, which launched when they launched Disney Plus, which we don't have over here yet. Um... So this is the character Baby Yoda, who right. if you haven't seen The Mandalorian, you've definitely seen memes of yes, this character. There's so many memes about Baby Yoda, it's great. Yeah. So when the series was launched back in November, they had kept it under wraps exactly what this character was going to be. So they hadn't made any toys in advance, they hadn't even done any designs because they didn't want it to leak. Mm. Which means they've now had a sudden epic rush to try and get all these toys ready because everyone loves him. That's and it, yeah. So you will be able to get Baby Yoda bikes, Baby Yoda water bottle, <laughs> Baby Yoda bobbleheads, Baby Yoda baseball cap, plush <laughs> Baby Yoda, plastic Baby Yoda, build your own Baby Yoda bear. <laughs> oh, okay. And also a slow blinking, ear wiggling Baby Yoda doll. Crikey, wow. I mean, you know, with these things, these sort of huge <laughs> phenomena, the merchandising must rake in so much money. Well, they, they reckon that this character alone could contribute to a 2% lift in the overall toy industry wow, wow. all that the is, toys wow that's that, massive that's insane yeah. and i think disney plus is uh, coming to sort of our shores potentially next, next month, month I, think. I think yeah i think it is march uh, you've got the answer i've got the answer i was being a bit stupid but should I just repeat the question it was what year did the queen's face last change on a banknote the options were 1990 1972 and 2005 what did we go with uh, 05 for i Sean. was going 05 yep. 72 for me it was 1990 oh, oh wrong <laughs> Well, there we go. We were there both, you are. We were fairly convinced there. We? We both, uh, both wider than 1990. Yeah. There you go. Indeed. And uh, finally, from me, we spoke earlier in the week about EastEnders celebrating 35 years on screen this week. And there's been these huge stunts on the Thames with this boat. I've seen a clip on Facebook with, surprise, surprise, Phil Mitchell brawling with somebody on deck with a gun in his hand holding it. Is it his son? Or it's the guy who used to be in Benedict. I've no idea. No, but it know. just looked classic sort of... 
EastEnders fun and games. Uh, and we mentioned the other day, is Dot still in EastEnders? Well, it has been confirmed that June Brown has actually left the role as Dot. It's all over the papers and everywhere this morning that June Brown has stood down as Dot Cotton after 35 years of playing oh. the role. 93 she is now. That's not bad. Uh, how old's is the programme? I mean, uh, 35. Well, so, there, you yeah, go. there you that's go. So amazing. She's, she's been there almost since day one, had a bit of time out in the 90s. Just thinking, Betty in Coronation Street, I think, was 91 when she died. 93 is, I think June Brown's got to be the oldest soap actress there's ever been, certainly on British screens. I don't think there's anyone mm. older than that who's kind of been in a soap, certainly as a regular character anyway. A spokesman for EastEnders says, though, the door remains open for her to return, but I think she's had enough. At 93, she's like, yeah, that's it. Apparently, Dot's moved, Dot's moved to Ireland. And oh. This has happened, but it's been confirmed she isn't coming back. But you never know. She might come back for a cameo appearance here and there with <laughs> the fag on in the laundrette, bless her.